Yo, all right, lads. So today we're going to be reviewing Inform Alexander Meyer of Eintracht Frankfurt. Now he's six foot five tall, right footed. He's got low, low work rates. He's got three star skills and a two star weak foot. Now his current price range is at 9.8 to 198k. That is across all platforms at the minute. So looking at his in games, he stands out to his 90 strength, 90 curve, 87 attack positioning, 87 finishing, and 87 shot power. We have also included all the upgrades from his non involved version as a comparison for you. So this is the team we were using him in, a 4-5-1 Bundesliga side with Inform Meyer up there at striker. So now to the game place you can see how he was performing. Now Meyer did get his Inform at camp, but I really do think converting him back up to striker is the best thing to do. Like we did, I really do think striker is his main position. While he does have good passing, I think there are a lot, lot better, better options to play at camp in the Bundesliga with obviously a lot more agility and a lot better pass in the, than Maya as well. Now he does make a great target man though with that six foot five height. Now his jumping isn't the best but he still does manage to get up to win most aerial battles. Does take advantage of that 90 strength as well. So great for getting up for flick ons to flick on those goal kicks. Now his pace is not good, neither is his agility or dribbling to be honest, but it doesn't feel as poor as it does in FIFA 15, as you probably know in 16 pace is not that much of an issue, and you can use that strength for hold up play as well, strength is a big factor this year, to prevent you from getting dispossessed so easily, like a lot of the weaker players uh, seem to be uh, getting dispossessed, it can open up some space for you for some chances on goal as well, and his shooting was quality, 87 finishing and 87 seven for shot power did finish most of his chances well in and outside of the box as well they get a couple from outside of the box decent enough finishes as long as it is on his right does only have a two star weak foot now we did only take a couple of chances on that left but they were quite poor so try and stick to his right as much as you can and of course he is a threat in the air as well with that six foot five height now we did only manage one with his head but i was still trying to suss out the cross and it does seem a bit weird this year it does seem most crosses just seem to magnetize to the goalkeeper they just always drift into the goalie's hands but I'm sure we'll get that sorted as we try and practice but Maya, he did take up some great positions in the box so he's so he's a attack positioning can't be faulted great great positioning does open up some space if you get those perfect crosses in so let's have a look at inform Meyer's performance stats so in six games he didn't manage to bang in eight goals did get one assist as well all his stats are on the left all the goal information is on the right there at the top that position map at the bottom does show you where his goals were scored and those assists were created as well so overall, we're going to give Inform Meyer an 8 out of 10. Solid score. That is for playing as a striker, by the way. Obviously, we were reviewing him as a striker. And I do think you will get more out of him at a striker rather than as a cam. So hopefully this year, a lot more people are going to be trying out the slower players, especially as there seems more emphasis on passing and strength uh, this year rather than pace. So the big, strong players can definitely dominate this year instead of being getting left by the wayside. A lot more players should be trying him. So we do urge you to go out there and try some slower players. Good option if you're looking for a target man. It's fairly cheap as well. I got mine for 12k, already converted to a striker, which is a good price in my, my opinion. So finally, I'm just going to leave you with Maya's positives and negatives to look at. Now, as we said, he is slow. He's not the most agile player in the world either, but his positives do far outweigh his negatives. Makes a great target man, as we said, for a Bundesliga side or a German side if you're making one. Good play to try at the start of FIFA. Nice cheap in form to get going with if you do fancy uh, playing with a target man. He defo is worth a try in my opinion. So please smash a like if you did enjoy the video. It does help me out a lot. And please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. Loads of FIFA 16 stuff coming. Loads of reviews. We're going to do as many different squad builders as we can. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. I really do appreciate y'all. Cheers, lads. See you later.